quantity, it's the quality. And Ramio's got both. <laughs> That's uh, quite the winning record over there. But we'll get this underway. Racers are readying up. The triple seven in the seed, very lucky. Each level has a luck charm hidden somewhere in it. That'd be neat. That'd be a fun treasure hunt, maybe. Probably not. <laughs> but we're off early cracked wall on 1-1. One -one. Both racers are gonna check it immediately. And boots of strength and a torch. Harps the gold weapon. I think we take everything in here. Maybe keep the dagger just for a throw if we need to. But like, we can make up for that with gold kills and it looks like people are, are all gonna take it. And we could have did a safe uh, safe kill there because in the two sub rooms here are uh, stack of bombs and a regular bomb. Which both racers pick up. Gold kill for Tuffo. Graviel's gonna have the exact same gold kill. And there's another stack of bombs. Finally on to one too, but tons of stuff already. Shop check for Tuff, Crown of Thorns. Gonna leave it there. Red chest and something else. Titanium spear. Uh, Ravio is gonna buy something here. Yeah, gonna buy the Crown of Thorns. Needed to bomb the walls for some more money. Tuffo checking the tier three locked wall. It's the pawn shop. And there's a rapier on uh, one, two that both racers collected. We'll be taken down. And then a brighter torch on one, three before headed into the zone one boss. It's Kanga. 10 bombs, I imagine we use one of those to get into phase two. Could use the blood drum, but like, why? It's half a heart. Just use a bomb. Usually zone two is where you find all the bombs. Yeah, both racers. Oh, Ravio's gonna use a blood drum there. I guess it's quicker because you don't have to go down and chase the monkey. But not too much saved. Scroll of Need. Ravio uses it right away and gets the Squagasu. Tuffo's gonna see what they do and is gonna follow suit. Gets the same. That's a metal slime with a red nose. And a shovel pickup for Ravio in the two on shop. The blood shovel. They'll pair together with uh, the crown of thorns. But this adventure bat. <laughs> Forcing Ravio to clear out the entire room before uh, getting the attack in where Tuff was able to go down without any problems. And there's so many more stacks of bombs. And a conjurer shop for Tuff, gonna get a shovel, pickaxe, and then a ring of peace. Not bad. Ravio's gonna get that peace ring right away and head on down. That's a big mushroom. But sort it out. And Ravio using a blood drum to get through there quicker, but Tuffo is down first to Deep Blues. Simple fight here. Just gotta take out the front line there and get the checkmate. And did neither check the chest? I didn't see any grabs there. Transmute shop on 3-1. Tough going for another shovel. Gets glass. <laughs> Gonna break it for the extra money. And ends up with titanium. Uh, Ravio's gonna have to bomb a wall to get that titanium shovel. Very expensive titanium shovel. I was just gonna leave, okay. Maybe saw that it was titanium over on Tough's side, but like, blood drum with pickaxe is uh, not a thing you wanna be stuck with, as it were. a gigantic beetle Ravio using a blood drum to make it go a bit quicker but Tuffo is pushing forward here 
Taking a few hits, down to just two hearts. No way to regen health there. Or Ravio is able to. Both racers on Coral Rift, the zone three boss. Be using some more bombs here. There's so many bombs. Imagine a blood drum used for Ravio here. Make it quicker. There it is. Duffel is gonna have to deal with these tentacles before getting hit there, losing a flawless victory. I doubt they would check uh, the chests anyway, but that's another health tick gone. Oh, wow, Ravio using uh, a bomb and eating the blast, knowing that they'd have enough health from that ham to regen it all, and the armor protecting themselves. Kind of a bold move. Tough will miss that altogether, I think. But it looks like they found uh, an apple along the way. Or some type of healing, but we're both down to 4 2, relatively the same time. Here's a monkey jump! For tough woe. He's gonna get one. Ravio's gonna take him out. Oh, tough taking armadillo hit, yellow skeleton hit. Squagga suit getting some dents in it. But still holding true. Ravio taking a few hits in this exit room as well. A lot of ghoulums just like covering up enemies and being slow and terrifying. Monkey for Ravio took it. <laughs> Looked like they were uh, contemplating if they wanted to or not. Getting surrounded by many enemies here. Not sure that monkey helps too much. Tuffo in the exit room. Gonna go clubbing and bomb themselves because they got confused. Half a heart. Bit scary. But into Fortissimo, your zone four boss. Ravio just getting down into it. Flawless victory for Tough. Might want to check for some health. Yeah, they're going to go check the red chest. Finds a blast helm. It's panic button at least. And Ravio's going to go straight down the stairs into zone five. Keeping it close. There's some health grab for Tough Will getting two purple hearts in the shop, but that's going to allow Ravio to take a slight lead here. Crown of Thorns gonna do a bunch more work. Overtime maybe in uh, zone five, stand on that wire and just take out all these enemies. And Ravio's gonna find a glass shop on 5-2 and switch off to the glass shovel. But it's gonna break, so that's just wasted time, unfortunately. And now Tuffo's back in the lead on to 5-3. It was a good thought, but Needed to play it safe then, and we haven't been playing it safe this entire run. Been so many hits. And Tuffo's into Dead Ringer. It's gonna be a right side spawn, so easy left side scoots. Go, 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 go. Ravio unable to do the blood drum kill here at half a heart. And Ravio's not gonna get enough heals to even use that. Blood drum on uh, the Necker Dancer. Where Tuffo was able to. Down to those purple hearts now. And Ramiel's got to be careful here. Tuffo's already got four hits on the Necker Dancer, and Ravio just getting into phase two. Looks like Tuffo's going to take the first loot. There you go, just over eight minutes. GG. Well, this is a match of three, so we'll get two more races yet. Let's see if Ravio can sweat. Ravio's got the beat on in the, uh, <laughs> in the lobby, <laughs> great. All right, seeds are entered, readying up. Get into the second seed. And we're off. Nothing looking in 1-1 right now. Just kind of going through, the there's a crack wall. 
We got a conjurer. You need a hundred gold to buy the first item in that. So if we can get 50, we can bomb the wall, but it's kind of a lot to ask for on 1-1. One, one. So we won't see that through the rest of the run. As our racers are heading down into 1-2. There's a blood shop immediately on one, two. Uh, Ravio's gonna check it out while Tuff sees what's in that red chest. It's a uh, torch. Ravio's gonna buy their torch from the shop. And uh, it's a headgear uh, blood shop. You got your ear muffins, your crown of thorns, and then there's a gold cutlass. Tuff was gonna go for the throw kill and gets it. So they should be able to have uh, a big damage boost here. And a gold cutlass. Ravio ended up just buying those ear muffins. And found some cheese, so we'll be able to heal back whenever they feel. Also find some quartz armor on 1-3. Tuffle just making it down to 1-3 as Ravio enters the coral rift fight. Easy throw bomb kill. As they kept off of that gold cutlass. I feel that's fair. You're going to switch off uh, the weapon here anyway, I think. Unless you plan on not dropping a beat the entire run, which sometimes it's faster to drop the beat. But Raviel finds a obsidian flail in that black chest. Buying a battle shovel on 2-2. Two, two. Yeah, it looks like there's an urn here. And Raviel's just able to open it. It's a pretty dang good urn. Ham, a heavy plate, and a shield spell. Uh, Tuffo should be able to open it too. Either with gold or that blood, uh, blood drum. But Raviel already into Kanga, your zone 2 boss. Gonna bomb the throne and take out that king. I imagine checking black chest here. Flail's okay, but uh, okay. Checks purple and is gonna get rewarded with the ring of regen. And then uh, a potion right away on 3 1. So that's really good. Uh, Ravio's going to be able to heal quite a bit. But there's that flail snag. Yeah, and Tuff's gonna stay on the cutlass here. That ring of regen's just like super important. We can blood shield for like most of the run now if we need to. Tuffle grabs that potion and has to use a few blood drums here. Okay, shielded and then blood drummed the tier two wall when they could have just dug to the left. Ravio getting snagged on all these enemies. Finds a bomb charm, though. That purple chest. Look at all these enemies. Tuffo taking a few hits, too. A bunch of parries on his friendly uh, lava slime there. Just some slime hugs. And here Tuffo's going to get a weapon switch in the Shrine of Peace and enchanting the dagger to get a jewel dagger. Right now dishing out seven damage. With that, uh, with those ear muffins. But Ravio does take the lead down to Fortissimo first by a few beats. Still on this flail. Let's see what they do with it after this flawless victory. Which both racers get. Tuffle is straight down in his own four. Ravio's going in black chest, finds the Ob's longsword. Uh, it's, it's not as snaggy. But it's not any faster than like a flail would be. That's a pretty big telemonkey though. They're gonna keep up here with Ravio. Or with Tuffo. And then crab in the monkey's paw. Tuffo finds a uh, transmute shop on 4-2. Gonna look for a shovel. Gonna settle for the glass shovel. And then get a blast helm. Ravio went for a glass shovel, now going for a weapon. Uh, and then the big dig got the obsidian harp. That's a little bit better. Get some splash damage going. Oh, taking a few hits. Thanks for that heavy plate. Stack of bombs on 4-3. Both racers find that 
So bombs aren't a problem here. The nice thing about the harp is you can see Ravio just ignore enemies, scoot on past them, and if they do manage to catch up, you just hit hit the enemy in front of you. And we're in sync in the deep blues. Throw a kill for Tuffle, that's all you need when you got a uh, jewel dagger. Looks like they're, uh... oh yeah, they switched off the blast dome for the ear muffins. But into zone five first, not afraid to use that blood drum to dig through these walls, but does have the glass shard here. And keeping it close again, five, two, Tuffle just a few beats ahead. Both racers scooting around these enemies into the exit room. And then shield spell and we're gone. Good shield for tough. Just get me to that dragon, gonna blood drum kill it, and then getting a bit caught up here, but we'll get through and we're on the dead ringer at the same time. Ravio making up some time there. It's a left side spawn. What are we going to do? Tuffo is doing something. Oh, blood drums. Ravio is going to do Japanese strats. Blood drums uh, are much faster. Both racers have enough bombs. Uh, Tuffo has that first hit with the blood drum as well and a very quick stage destruction with the blast down. There's the first hit already. Look how much faster this is going to... Well, Ravio's got the big bombs. They help a lot too. But Tuffo gets that early first hit. Dorian with a flail. We like to see that. You don't got to worry about Dorian too much there. And it looks like Tuffo is going to take this one over Ravio again. Sub 7 in game. 7.09 race time. That's fast. GG's. Uh, looks like uh, Ravio didn't realize how far behind he was due to twitch delay. Uh, that's something I learned last season. I was using Mac, Mac SG to watch my opponent, and Mac SG is like 45 seconds behind. So they would be like dot dunning when I'd get into Dead Ringer, and I'm like, what? You just got into Dead Ringer. <laughs> Should really use. Uh, Twitch to watch that. Not Mac SG. Alright, here's our final seed. Let's see if Tuffle can get the sweep. Ravio trying to get at least one loot here. And they're off. Black chest on one one's got some armor in it. And we'll pretty much be moving through the rest of this level. Now there's a blood shop. We can bomb for that. What's inside? Torch shop with a gold staff. Both racers just grab the foresight and head on out. Be into one, two. A tough one taking the skeleton hit there. Didn't want the monkey hug. Stack of bombs, maybe a lock shop? See those early bombs right away? There is a real Shrine of Darkness here. Both racers gonna grab that. Tuffle heads straight down the trap door. Ravio's gonna check the shop. Doesn't look like a lock shop. There's a door on the mini-map. But we'll be able to steal from that. Tuffle in the 1-3 shop, gonna steal in there. Battle shovel, ear muffins, and cookies. Ravio getting a rapier and some cheese. There was a ring of gold in there, but we still want to keep the darkness ring to uh, steal later. And a titanium broadsword find for Ravio. Gonna go for that. But Tuffo into the zone. Uh, one boss, it's core riff, easy thrill bomb. And you're gonna see a glass longsword in the black chest. That's not great.
but dealing out six damage with those ear muffins still. More thievery for tough after uh, murdering that leprechaun. <laughs> Just a bunch of bad dancers here, taking everything. Ooh, a blood staff pick up for Tuffo. Currently dealing three damage, but if we drop a beat, that's gonna be a bit rough. We do have the battle shovel. It's gonna always do that. And Raviel finding a heal spell in the purple chest. Did not want that glass, and I don't blame him. Has the broadsword anyway, I mean, that you're doing four damage with that. Pretty good. Yeah, Raviel's not going shopping in zone two at all. Headed straight to the exits, trying to do a bit of catch up here. Tuffo's done with zone two. See what this boss is. It's deep blues. We can set up a laser kill here. Just don't get knighted. Good work. Flawless victory. Let's see what we go for here in the chest. Going purple finds a uh, pulse tomes. Gonna grab him. Gravio into that deep blues fight. Gets pawned. So no flawless victory there. And into zone three. Looks like that shop's kind of out of the way. You're usually not checking your level one shops anyway, just because of the tier level of items in it. I mean, sometimes you can find good stuff in it, but it's usually low tier items. But Ravio's starting to lag a bit behind again. Tuffo into 3-3. Three, three. It finds an obsidian whip in a chest. No thanks. Also a miner's cap. Uh, yeah, don't, don't want to switch off your damage ears there. Ravio might consider it. No, they're going to stay on their ears too. The Tuffo down to your zone three boss first is death metal. Ravio just a few beats behind. Oh, Tuffo taking a beetle hit there, but gets done. It was a planned beetle hit to get infinite damage with the blood staff. Oh, we need to keep an eye on Tuffo here. Uh, lasers in zone four can lead to across the screen teleports. <laughs> it's pretty good if, if you're actively thinking about it the entire time. Um, but sometimes you can hit a golem and then teleport. And it just so turns out that you teleported onto Goo, and then you got hit in the same beat, and it's like, what the heck's happening? All right, Tuffo grabbing a uh, Ring of Regen at that 4-1 exit. Looks like, I'm sorry, Tuffo grabbed that. No, sorry, um, what? Ravio did not. Ravio moving on. That's a great find for Tuffo, especially with uh, lasers in zone four again. Watch that monkey. Oh, tough whoa, the laser goo. <laughs> I'm counting that as commentator curse. That's one for me shooting for 10. <laughs> Not even mad. <laughs> yeah, it's a good, that's a good death. <laughs> you saw Ravio stop there for a bit to see that uh, tough whoa went down. And yeah, slow play procedures for Ravio. They're going straight to the shop. All right, let's check out that death on Tuffo's side. They're going to shoot up and hit a golem and then get trapped by harpies and <laughs> plate masters. That's good stuff. So it looks like Ravio is going to pull at least one loot out here. Well, we'll see how their slow play procedures go here some uh some racers tend to do worse when they play slow or sometimes going fast is just safe but ravio did find snow bro here put it in the up position found some earth tomes as well And into the zone four boss, it's Fortissimal. Tough will going for uh, the blood drum this time.
good earth tome kill for ravio there maybe get off this ring just so we all can see what's going on transmute tomes not a ring with that full mapping in zone five we'll be able to see where the shop is can head straight there stand on the, the wire and um take out everything i'm gonna do some transmutes and uh get a titanium rapier looks like bit of a weapon upgrade there and boots of strength yeah the <laughs> with the darkness can't tell what color that dragon is and raviel correct correctly uh retreating a little bit there as it was an earth dragon a lot of health Speaking of health, potion on 5-2. Oh, tough uh, <laughs> scouting the uh, the seed and finding better stuff. Yeah, you'll have that. 1-2 Shriner with Obsidian Cat. Finally, Ravio gets off the ring. Had to transmute for it, though. Picked up some heavy glass too, but we can see. Amazing. Good preemptive shield there, and now we'll try to rush to the exit. Heavy plate in that shop too. Could even just buy it there, but uh, heavy glass, you don't lose hearts when uh, you get hit, unlike heavy plate. Ravio hit a boss shrine somewhere? Missed it. But into Dead Ringer has a very quick kill here if they recognize it. Um, the frost ring with snow bro but it's a right side spawn so easy left side scoot and a bomb charm in the red chest so this is all pretty much ravio here just gotta keep dad safe should be fine it's dad's weapon a long sword that's kind of gross Ravio's even going to spend a little more time here building up the shield spell. Putting Dad in the corner. Yeah, you stay there. Maybe the top corner. Okay. I suppose that makes sense. Yeah, he's, he's going to move up a bunch here, so. But we're into phase two. Oh, Dad got hit. Rip flawless victory. Just a few more hits here though. There it is. Ravio gonna rally and get one loop back. 10.44 race time after them slow play procedures. GG and tough woe playing Sudoku with those heal spells.